There's numerous thinkers that believe that we have a kind of compassion instinct that seems to be innate to our humanness that has made us successful in social groups. This idea that we can feel what others are feeling, we can take on their perspectives, we can empathize, we can be compassionate to the other's point of view. I would say that when we do have moments of extreme compassion, we feel connected to other people, we feel empathetic to, to the feelings of others, it makes us feel less alone, it makes us feel like we're having some kind of communion with the other and there's an ecstasy that comes with smashing our sense of separateness. I had a conversation with the psychologist Esther Perel and she told me that people who are really compassionate, that tends to be rooted in people who are really, really, really close to their parents. What does that mean that you were close to your mother growing up? Well, it means that you were really, really attuned to her, to feel what she felt and her feeling what you felt, right? And so people who are really, really, really close to their mother or father then grow up to be these really empathetic beings who, you know, in a way have to really kind of control their environment because like they're gonna feel the vibe of the room. They're gonna feel the vibrations from other people. They're like almost too empathetic. But you know, if it weren't for that, you wouldn't see all these wonderful acts of, of, of compassion and, and generosity that you see among human beings in, in wonderful situations. So it's, it's, compassion is definitely a beautiful thing.